Hey guys, it's Daniel Cabrera Versoft here with the GSG 522 RAS Electric Blowback AEG. Um, this is the shooting test, like I said, and this gun was uh, given to us for review and shooting test by airsoftstation.com. Make sure you go check their website out. Amazing stuff and um, really cool gun. So uh, let's just get around right on into it. Alright, guys, this is going to be five rounds of semi from about 25 feet. And um, after I shoot the five shots, we'll just go up and look at what we have. And also do a round of um, just a few bursts. Now we'll do that full auto. Go check it out. Alright guys, so I fired about 14 shots, um, including the bursts I did. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So 10 out of 14 shots hit. Um, the ones I missed on was the burst. Uh, with the burst, I noticed, at least with 20 gram BBs, the shots that I fired were a little more off to the right. I think just because the hop up is so strong on the weapon that um, it, the 20 grams it really spins off. So um, have three shots in the black, none in the bullseye, um, and um, a lot on the outer part, and only one actually didn't make it inside the circle of the ones that hit the target. So nine out of fourteen was um definitely a a hit in a game if you're aiming at somebody. And um, let's uh, go back to fifty feet and see how it shoots. All right, guys. So now we're at the 50-foot test of the GSG 522, and um, same thing: five semi shots and then three, three round bursts. Okay, another burst. All right, let's go see what it did to the target. All right, guys. So um. Pretty much the same results. We had nine out of fourteen shots hit the paper. There was less in the in the actual um, circles than there was um, on the other target. So obviously it's a little less accurate from fifty feet. But um, enough about that. Let's see what it can do from a hundred feet, and then we'll go to the Corona. All right, guys. Now we're at the hundred foot test for the GSG five two two. We're going to do five semi shots, three three round bursts, and then after the results, we'll go to the chrono. Alright, let's go see the results. Alright, guys, so this is the 100 foot results. Seven out of 14 shots hit the paper, um, and five of those. Seven were actually within the uh, human target torso of the target here. Um, what I recommend for this gun, if you do get it, the GSG 522, uh, is to use 25 gram BBs. Um, 20 seem to be too light, uh, especially with the hop up. I have it all the way down right now, and the wind's not too bad, so just recommend using 25 gram BBs. Um, and right now, we'll just go to the chrono and finish this video up. All right, guys, so we're here at the chrono. I'm just going to do feet per second and rounds per second. So first we're going to do three semi shots to uh, get an average feet per second and then three three round bursts to get an average rounds per second. So first with the semi. First shot, 397.3 feet per second. Second shot, 399.2 feet per second. Third shot, 400.9 feet per second. Um, so obviously around... 400 as an average, which is pretty damn good. I know a lot of people like higher FPS weapons. So now we're going to go to the bursts. Alright guys, so now we're going to do the bursts and get the rounds per second. That's 11 rounds per second. That's 10.9 rounds per second. And 10.62 rounds per second. So average of about 11 rounds per second. That's with 20 gram BBs and uh, half charged battery. And um, that's it for the shooting test, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Again, this is the GSG 522.
from airsoftstation.com. Electric blowback too. So very nice. Um, the review up, the review will be up for it very soon, and look forward to that. And we'll see you guys later.